how to make a game on Roblox Mobile. There's no secret that Roblox games can make you a ton of Robux. But there was one problem. Making games on Roblox used to require one thing, a computer or a laptop, and maybe some coding experience. Well, in this video, I found how to make Roblox games on mobile, and how to have your game make you tons of Robux. I actually have a lot of games, and believe it or not, I actually started by making games on my mobile. I actually discovered this method about two years ago and nobody has ever spoken about it. And it literally still works. This game I made on my mobile about two years ago and I did not touch it since. It still makes me 200 Robux every day. And in the past eight months, it's actually made me still around 100,000 Robux. You could do it within like a few minutes. So make sure you keep watching. This could actually change your life. You could literally do this so easy. Also, very quickly, I do have Robux on my group and I can actually give you some if I enter in your username here. So if you do want some, leave a like and sub and drop your Robux usernames in the comments. So if you want both of those things, make sure you watch this whole video throughout. Even if you skip 10 seconds, you might miss something important and it won't work for you. As you you might be like this guy. Yeah, don't be him. Let's get into the video. As you see right here, I am on the Roblox mobile app right now. And as you see right here, there's actually nothing you can do. Obviously, you might be thinking the create button right here. Once you do actually press the create button, there's no real way to actually make a game. Like, it just says stuff like this, like view all your experiences. And if you did try to make one, obviously you can't do anything. Yeah, there's literally nothing you can do. You can look at that one game that you do earn. Now, everybody does actually own like a game. Obviously, it's like a base template game kind of and you can't really do anything. It's kind of like titled like this. Like, it's like your username and it's like number one or something like that for you maybe. But yeah, there is literally nothing else here. I mean, it's literally, they don't really want you to make games on Roblox Mobile, but we are going to do it anyway and it's pretty good to be fair. The only thing you can actually do on this part is literally change the name of it. I mean, let me try find something right here so you can view on Roblox. Roblox. I mean, yeah, there's pretty much nothing else really here. You can change the name. That's about it, really. So, yeah, let's just leave that right there. And, yeah, let's actually get into it. All right, so right now, I am on Google or literally any device or any platform you can search up Roblox on. Now, obviously, I am on my phone and I've got iPhone, so I've got Safari and I've literally just Googled it. And, yeah, so obviously, what you want to do first is, of course, look up Roblox. We are going to go from like the desktop version of Roblox onto like our Chrome pretty much. So obviously right here I've just typed it in and it looks pretty much exactly how it would like on a computer. So firstly what you want to do is of course do that and then obviously press onto Roblox. Now it does come with a lot of stuff right here and this is the first like most important part. It says Roblox for iOS continue in app and they want you to press that. If you see right here at the bottom it says continue in browser right at the bottom it's really dark and we want to go ahead and press view in browser now the next thing you want to do is of course log in now I've never logged into like Roblox through my desktop on my phone so obviously I have to sign up again but if you have before in the past then you might already be logged in so yeah I'm going to go ahead and log in right now all right so I'm just logged in again and it actually comes up with this again now obviously you want to go ahead and press continue in browser again and it was right at at the bottom. Now, we are now on pretty much the full version of Roblox, but we are on our phone. Now, this is actually how it looks like on my computer. As you see, I play on computer mainly. I don't really play on my mobile phone. My, my arms kind of hurt after a while for some reason when I play on my mobile. Like, I'm just not used to it at all. Maybe my hands are big, but I'm not too sure. But firstly, now, this is what you want to do. So you don't have to press anything at all. And obviously, I'm on my iPhone right now. So on my iPhone, what I'm going to do is press this double A at the bottom left right here and it will actually come up with this right here request desktop website and i want to go ahead and press uh, request desktop website and you may be thinking it does nothing but it will do later on now if you're on android there should be something on the screen what it should look like if you are on your android <laughs> And 
yeah, it's pretty simple to do, really. The next, what I'm going to do is simply just press onto create right here at the top. And yeah, now once we are on this, it will look very similar to how it looks like on the Roblox app. And yeah, the thing is, as you see right here, it is a tiny bit different. You get a lot more access and this access will help you create games on Roblox. So obviously right here, we've got pretty much everything again. You got your game, you've got pretty much how it is, except this thing right here. Create experience. Now, this is where it does get interesting to be fair. And as you see, when I do press it, it will say download studio and it will try download something. So obviously you can go ahead and do that, but it's not fully done though. Like there's something I do need to explain because for a lot of people, it doesn't do anything. It will try download something and nothing will happen. But one thing you can do is actually edit games like this, checking for Roblox studio. And it's kind of weird to be fair how it works is, but there's one thing you can do to get players. Now, if you're watching right now, keep watching because even if you have a simple game, if you just change the title of it, you could get players and actually make Roblox from it. And I kind of wanted to show you how it went. So pretty much what I did was I changed my name to like a trendy topic. And if I go back onto my Roblox page right here, my game is just a simple, like pretty much it's the most simple game like you have on your desktop browser. Now the game, I did this for like a little test to see if it's true and it's actually made me like around 10,000 Robux and pretty much what I did is literally change my name to this, like literally I just titled it this and I just wanted to see what would happen to see if it was actually true and yeah as you see right here, all I did was just change the logo and yeah as you see it's got 36 thousand visits and I didn't even do anything like if I go back onto the create part right here and if I just go onto my group that I did it on then if I go ahead and press it as you see it's right here and if I wanted to go ahead and yeah I could pretty much do anything so let me just go ahead and press onto this right here and yeah you can literally see right here like settings right here and go ahead and change the name of the game and if you guys wanted to see how much robux has this game made let's just go ahead and find out right here so in the past 72 hours it's made like 1500 robux if i go yeah look so the past 30 days it's made over 11,000 robux i mean it's pretty insane like i mean on one day it made over well almost 2000 robux and that is quite a lot just for, like a simple game and it's something you guys should do and yeah that is how to make a game on roblox no.